All right, guys, I think it is about time that we finally talk about this. You guys want to see it. Today, we are going to talk about the Battle of Titans. On the one side, we do have the Glitch Pop Dagger that was released with the second act. One of the best knives to ever release in Valorant till today. And on the other side, we do have a tough opponent with the Weaver Dagger. The most hyped knife in the game, I feel like, especially during the period in which it was taken out of the game until it came back. I feel like no skin ever had such a hype like the Reaver skins, especially the Reaver knife. So we do have a tough battle here. I am not quite sure as to which skin is better. Honestly, I do like them both. So that's where you guys come into play. And as always, I did ask you guys which knife you do prefer. And I'm going to roll the results in right now. And it is a result that I did not quite expect. However, you guys spoke. It is quite apparent that you like the glitch pop a lot more than you like the Reaver knife. I would have thought that that would be a bit more balanced. But apparently there is a huge tendency towards the glitch pop knife. And we want to figure out why that is. So first of all, let's start by comparing the prices of each knife. On the left side, we do have the glitch pop dagger, which starts at 4,000. 350 Valorant points and on the right side we do have the Reaver Dagger which starts at 3550 Valorant points. Both of these knives also come with upgradable effects which means if you max both of these out there is still a difference of almost 1000 Valorant points in between. The Glitch Pop Dagger obviously being the more expensive one and people still tend to pick the Glitch Pop Dagger over the Reaver Dagger. And usually it's the other way around. People like to buy skins that are not as expensive but in this case Apparently, people do prefer the more expensive skin. So let's jump into some in-game footage to see what this is all about right now. So the first thing I want to talk about is the fact that this knife without any animations, without any VFX effects on level 1 looks so fucking clean and I personally might even prefer the vanilla level 1 version over the upgradable VFX effects which we get with the level 2 version because it just looks so clean without any of the RGB lights next to it but the effects that you get with the level 2 version are also sick as hell, you can't deny that. The fact that it changes the color with every pull you make or like randomizes the color is awesome. We never had something like that before. So that's a nice addition to the level 2 version. So overall we can say that the Glitch Pop Dagger both with the level 1 and level 2 version is just a sick knife. A really clean looking knife and one of the best designs that we have in game in my opinion. But now let's check out the Reaver Dagger right now. Now. So I have to admit that I do not like the vanilla version, the level 1 version of the Reaver Dagger too much. I think without any effects it looks a bit boring, it isn't anything special. So in that department I definitely have to give it to the Glitch Pop Dagger if we just compare the vanilla versions. However, the upgraded version, level 2, looks awesome. I feel like the sound effects and the visual effects obviously change so much in the appearance of the knife. I feel like it makes it so much better. I definitely like how it looks when you upgrade it. So overall, I have to say the Reaver Dagger with upgrades is a pretty solid knife. It looks nice, it sounds nice, and overall it's just beautiful. And this is a case in which I don't necessarily can say the Glitch Pop Dagger is better or the Reaver Dagger is better because we do have two completely different themes here as well, right? Which we have to keep in mind because there are people that prefer the Glitch Pop theme way more than they prefer the Reaver theme, for example, even though both knives look nice so i don't 
have a definite choice for this specific battle. I personally play the Glitch Pop Dagger more than I play the Reaver Dagger just because I used the Reaver Dagger so much in the beta already to a point where I just overplayed the skin. But nevertheless, both knives are super awesome. So at the end of the day, you guys have to look into your own preferences. Do you like the Reaver theme more than you like the Glitch Pop theme? And do you also have to look at the prices because 1k Valorant points almost is the difference between both of these knives. So if you can't afford too much skins, you might be better off with the Reaver Dagger if you don't care and you just like the clean look of the Glitch Pop knife. You might be better off with the Glitch Pop Dagger. Let me know in the comments down below what you think, what you guys prefer and which skin you bought and which skin you play. And as always, if you do like the content, make sure to subscribe down below, be a part of this community, make sure you participate in these skin polls and feel free to like the video. Maybe we can hit 500 likes in the first week if you do enjoy. And as always, I see you guys on the next one.